Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nana, and today I am back with another cast for you guys. I really wanted to make a beautiful chocolate lady, but the skin and the reshade and the makeup was all clashing with each other. So I had to make her a bit more on the lighter caramelly side, but I still think she turned out really nice and I love her hair. Sometimes I look at these hairstyles and I think I wish my hair could do this. Like I wish someone could do this to my hair or my hair was like, this texture because it just looks so good. My hair is just there. <laughs> it just exists, it flops around. Oh my god, you guys. I am so tired today. I just went to the gym. I have so much to do today. Oh my god, I had to make beef at the pharmacist. I've been using the same medication for 20 years. I asked her for my prescription and she's like, well, yeah, the doctor prescribed you a new one. So what you're gonna have to do is go back to the doctor to get a prescription for the old one. I'm like, but I have a prescription for the old one. Couldn't you just refill the old prescription? It's like, no, because it expired when you didn't come and refill it. So I went to the doctor and I, I'm like, well, I would like my old prescription, but she won't give it to me because she says I have to get a new prescription for the old one because I got a new prescription for something new, but I don't want the new one. I just want the old one because I know the old one works. Back to the pharmacist, like, oh, in walking distance, literally like two minutes walk. So I go back and she's like, oh, you're back. I'm like, yeah, I went to the doctor like okay so she takes it and she's like oh okay being very nice my mom said she was enjoying the show <laughs> i got a little bit feisty right there a bit of kareny right kareny but as long as you do it politely it's still within the boundaries of being respectful i will just i will not disrespect you but i will respectfully disagree with you i mean i get it but it also just ugh, it was just so annoying it was really annoying like Wasted 20 minutes just to get what I wanted, only because he didn't want to give it to me, like, right away. I didn't know she was gonna give me a new prescription. She said, oh, I'll refill or I'll get you a prescription for the dust medication. Okay. I just kind of assumed she would give me what I've always been using, but not something new. So, I mean, yeah, I guess it's my fault for for not noticing that on time. But still, why get why something new? The old one worked fine. <laughs> I think she just wants to promote this new product and she's like using me as a test subject like oh yeah she survived the other one let's test this one out and see if she gets any weird lumps on her face when i have my medication i don't really notice a difference and i think because i've been taking it so long i just kind of forgot what it does and then usually when i am like actively triggered i guess and having an allergic reaction i know what it feels like but normally i don't really feel anything i just I guess I do feel stuff, but I just think it's normal. Like I got used to feeling this this way, you know? It's like house mites and, and dust mites and whatever, cat mites. I don't know what's on my cat, don't wanna know. I guess there's more DNA of me on my cat because I keep, no, not that way. I keep kissing him. It sounded really oddly disturbing, but I meant it in a cute way. Like I love hugging and touching my cat. Imagine you're allergic to your own child and you're like, well, you know, son, it's time for you to move out at like six months old. Like, it's time for you to <laughs> venture out into the world because your daddy's allergic to you. I mean, my dad did that one. I think he's just allergic to being a parent. Good story, this. <laughs> Great story. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I am just gonna go and continue packing because I haven't done that. Out. I'm leaving tomorrow. I haven't packed. I haven't done anything. I've spoken nonsense on the YouTube, okay? On the YouTube. I was oh my god, today is one of these days. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day, you guys. I'm gonna pack because if I don't pack, I'm gonna be at the airport with literally like nothing but my phone and probably the clothes that I'm wearing which would be my pajamas. <laughs> I see videos of butt cracks and shorts and boobs and fats and everything hanging out and I don't know, a little bit of modesty goes a long way as well. So I wouldn't be surprised if, because there's so many people at the airport, if people actually showed up in their bikinis or like, I don't know, hiding whole laptops in the butt crack. Cause why not? Why pay for it when you can just shove it in there? Just, uh, sometimes it's good to have a little, uh, a few a few extra cracks and folds. You know? All right, I've definitely strayed too far off the path. Um, today so i'm gonna leave y'all be thank y'all so much for watching and i'll see y'all in the next video bye